the achiever and trying to get love. So the achiev achievers on the unhealthy side, they believe that they have no worth beyond their achievements. Like I have to achieve to get love. And we can see this, you know, especially, you know, uh, parents who told their kids, you know, you have to achieve, you have to do well, and this, you, have to do, you have to get, you know, good grades and a good job and make a certain amount of money. That some kids grow up now thinking that they have to, like, they are their achievements. You know, I feel like a somebody if I get a certain job or make a certain amount of money or achieve something if it's in sports. You know, I hate losing because losing is tied to no love <laughs> and winning is tied to love. So they exchange or they think, you know, if I achieve, then people will love me. And they might get the significance and people might love them, but they don't love who they really are. They really are inside. So the thing for an achiever to learn is that their their worth is not dependent on their achievements. No matter what your parents say, no matter what society or whoever says, your worth is not dependent on your achievements. Your worth is inside of you, and not even your worth, just who you are is inside of you. And that's where real self-esteem comes from, and that's where real confidence comes from. When you know that you're you, and it's not dependent on how great people think you are. You're just, you know you, and that's that's where you feel the love and that's where you feel